And so it begins. In the end, we all burn for our sins. Okay, what's up everybody? This is the Game Virus, also known as the G, -G, 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 -G Virus, and we are back with more Let's Play Silent Hill Blind. And last episode, I finally found all three keys that allowed us to find a path that would take us to the elementary school in hopes that we would find our daughter. And shit started getting real dark on us. The outside area went dark. I guess a solar eclipse happened or some shit. But we made our way inside of the elementary school after searching for what seemed to be the whole video for the damn keys. But we finally made it inside and it's dark as fucking here too. So our good buddy here, Harry Basin, has his flashlight out. And he's ready to do some more investigating. But uh... So, uh, yeah, it seems like there's so many places to go in here. Knowing this game, a lot of this shit will be locked. Shit, knowing survival horror games, a lot of these doors will be locked. I couldn't find a save point, so I'm picking up right where I left you guys, which I don't really like to do. I like to fucking save, but... I haven't died yet, so if I die now, I'll have to go back a pretty long while. But I'm gonna try. Oh, I can't look at any of these lockers. That's a waste of opportunity right there. You definitely was expecting some items to be in there but as soon as I find myself as soon as I find myself a save point I will definitely save I I'm sorry I have to do it I have to do it okay 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 hold on how do I turn around again I forgot the controls already man I just played this shit let's see it's a file here what is this a file oh more Ronaldo Gordon this must be the list of teachers okay well, it looks like I'm going to be in here trying to figure out what to do for a while, so let's go ahead and just start seeing if we can open up doors, man. There's a whole bunch of bloody books over here with shit written down, times, and, and all type of weird stuff. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to solve a puzzle using that. Just some bullets. A big window, that's never a good sign. Anytime there's a big window, it's like... Very possible something's gonna try to crash through and eat us and devour our faces. See if we can say anything about it. Nothing. Yeah. There's no key item in here. So I don't think anything's gonna crash through and try to eat us. It's usually that's how it goes. You get a key item and then some shit happens. Oh, look at this. A picture of a door. Are those hanging bodies? Yeah, this game is really grisly, you know? It, it, it doesn't hold back or skimp on the just the real mean-spirited gore. You know, people are getting fucked up here. A picture of a door. I don't know who drew it. But it is certainly in a bad... It, but, it, but it is certainly in bad taste. Yeah, this, a picture like this should definitely not be at a school. Hmm. So I'm pretty sure everything I've been looking at so far is like hints to puzzles and shit I'm gonna have to do to get stuff unlocked. Can I go past this chair? Can he push it? Yes, the chair's too heavy for him. Looks like there's something to be looked at or messed with back there. It's locked. Alright. I'm having control issues right now. He's running in places I don't want him to run. I'm using the analog stick for my movement, which is probably a bad idea. I should probably use the directional pad. Uh-oh! Oh, man! Did I go back outside? That sounded like there was something brutal out there. Why is the music still playing funny? Oh, man, it looked like there was something new out there. I heard moans and shit. The static sound different. Is this where I came in from? I don't even remember. Yeah, this is where I came in from. Alright. That door's a way out. I'm definitely not going back out there. At least not yet. There's gotta be something else more. I'm gonna be in here for a while, I can tell. Probably spent like three videos in here trying to figure shit out. Did I check this door yet? At least a lot of these doors are. What are you being hard for? What's your health looking like, buddy? Are you alright? You're fine. What the hell is wrong with this guy? I guess he's just scared shitless. 
Oh, oh fuck, there was a save point. Well, let me go ahead and save. I'll just save right here. And at the end of the video, I'll just save again. Right over that one. At least if I die, I won't have to go super far back. That's all that matters. All right, so this is an infirmary, so there should be tons of health kits in there. It should be more than that. Give me them all. There's a health drink. Yes, yes, yes. There's not another one? Come on. Just two? Come on. There was more health back at the the, the the cafe in the beginning of the game. There should be like several health items here. All these big windows are giving me like the heebie-jeebies. I just know something's gonna crash through though at some point. Once the shit starts hitting the fan, once I figure out what to do first, I think creatures are gonna start like pouring into here. Looks like I might have to go outside. Center that camera, get it behind. I'm gonna have to go outside. There's no place else for me to go. Yup. Damn, what the fuck's out there? When are they gonna give me a new weapon? What the fuck? Ah! Fuck! Shit. Those are those creatures that took us down the first time. When we first started playing. I have to go out there. There's no, there's no other choice. Yep. There's no other choice. Damn. So I just try to avoid those things. I remember those things run after you. Ah, this is gonna be bad. I don't even know where I'm going. It's so dark. I can't see shit. Fuck. Hmm. There's doors on the other side. I just gotta get to the other side of this courtyard right here. And not get stuck on benches. Don't get stuck on benches, Harry. Fuck you! Run into the wall. Ooh, I made it through that. Without even getting spotted, probably. Good shit. Oh, they're in here, though! Fuck! Those things are creepy. What are they? Are they kids? Fuck. Shoot the other one! What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, I got a gun now, assholes. They're still alive, I bet. Yep, you gotta put them down or what? Will they get back up or some shit? Yep, they will. That's cool. He's still alive. <sighs> Can I investigate these idiots? Alright, well. There it is, guys. We're no longer the victim. We, we, we fight back nowadays. Now that we got this damn gun. We fight back. That shit that happened in the beginning of the game, it's a distant memory now. You guys got you guys got a lot to deal with on your hands. Uh-oh. No, no, go back. Let's check out the smaller doors first. Before we go into a totally new area, the lock is jammed. This door can't be opened. Fuck. Alright, is there another small door in here? This one jammed too? Yup, the lock is jammed. The door can't be opened. Alright, and this one was locked as well. Sure was. These lockers still useless? These pink lockers? Yup. It's a nice setting, being in an elementary school. A friend in need. What is that for? This was like a, like, even if this place wasn't all dark and shit, this still looks like it'd be a creepy ass elementary school to go to. It was all old and shit. Come on, man. I don't like how that camera gets stuck facing us. What the fuck? Why is this door so small? Nothing inside. It must be some type of storage or something like that. Can't be like a regular door to go through. Well, small doors first. It's it's jammed. Great. There's not a lot of investigating to do. Like You can't just click on everything and get an explanation of what you're seeing. It's just a shame. I'm so used to that with our with Resident Evil. Yeah, everything's jammed up, huh? Jammed? What does that mean? What do I gotta do to unjam it? Take an axe to it? I guess these doors are just you're not supposed to go in there. I guess you're just not supposed to go in there. Yep. Yep. This one's this one's not jammed. I can tell it's a different color. 
Hold on now. So will they always let me know when an enemy is in the room by my radio? Seems like it's impossible for them to give me jump scares if that's the case, because I'll always know when they're nearby. What the hell is this? It's nothing? Looks like an item right there. Nothing over here. I don't even know what direction I'm facing. There we go. Alright, you know the drill. Check the stalls. Can't even check the stalls, huh? What? This is a useless room. It's a completely useless area. Huh. Okay. Nope. It's not that kind of game. Can't destroy environments. Oh, this is a totally useless area, though. Okay. Alright. Nothing to say about the faucets, either. Nothing to say about the sinks. Mashing that action button, nothing to be said, man. Just, I don't know. Why is the camera all close to you like that? I didn't like that. If there was something in here, I wouldn't have been able to see it fast enough. Is this where I came in from? I don't remember. Oh, it's unlocked. Definitely not. Oh, this is where I was. Well, here we go. Let's go upstairs. At the ready. Oh, stair stair climbing animation. Are we gonna get a shot of his tight ass running? I haven't seen that loading screen in a while. Harry Mason's tight ass in action. Somebody's here. Did these kids? I don't know what they are. Uh, put him down. Put him out of his misery. You're not getting at me with that knife. Why is he still... Okay. Yeah. I was still moving his body, which meant that he was still alive. Or at least it seemed like he was still alive. Oh, look at the little kid drawings. Oh. Can we get a close-up of those, Harry? No? Oh, man. Oh, I'm not even investigating these doors. Cause, oh, shit! I was thinking they're all jammed, but I guess not. Nothing in these lockers. This is cool. I like this. I like this setting. I haven't experienced a setting like this in a horror, survival horror game in a while. The last time I was in a school was like RE6, I think. Last of Us, you were in a school, but... This is definitely a more creepy vibe. A, a, a creepy... A creepier school. A more creepy approach. Well, there's nothing in anywhere. Nothing on the map telling me anything of any importance. Roof. We can get to the roof? Oh. Uh, so I guess those scribbles mean I can't go in there? Uh, that question mark means those books I was looking at. That's, that pretty much sums up how I'm thinking right now. The question mark with the books. I don't know what the fuck's going on there. All the doors I can't go into. There should just be a big exclamation mark on the courtyard written there. Because that shit's fucking, man, a whole bunch of enemies there. I didn't want to go in there. But pretty much that explains what I'm feeling. Oh, some of these, some of these drawings are creepy. Well, what does that, what does that drawing say? Well, I can't fucking say. Oh, who are you? So I guess L2 allows us to look around a bit, or it just makes the camera go up. Where are you? Show yourself. Fuck! Get off me! He's trying to give me fellatio. Trying to reload this bad boy real quick. Oh, no, oh, I'm good. How many bullets do I have left? Quite a few! Wow! Alright, not bad. Still haven't died, guys. There's some health over here. There's a 
health drink. Nothing useful in the desk drawer. Nothing useful in this place at all, to be quite honest with you. So I guess... Am I unjamming these doors or what? These are the doors that were jammed, correct? I like how the controller is just randomly vibrating. It feels like the controller is just randomly vibrating. It's weird. Oh man, I'm gonna get so turned around in this bitch. How the hell am I down here? Or is this another, is this another area? Oh yeah, this is to the roof. Hold on, we're not done investigating. Down here first. I'm pretty sure there's something key up there on the roof though. So these doors were all to the, uh, the classrooms, right? This is just where I was just at, right? Yeah. All right. So that's pretty much it for this level. This is the second floor. Uh, relax, Harry. You're all right. You'll 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 be okay, man. Oof. Stressing me out with all that heavy breathing. Cut that shit out. This was the bathroom, right? Or was no no no. What is this? This is definitely the bedroom. Settle down, man. Is that from running? What's your health look like? You're fine on health. Oh, no, I'm not. Uh-oh. Hold up, hold up. What's going on? Cheryl? Cheryl, is that you? Cheryl? 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 No. Sounded a little mature to be Cheryl. This is like the men's room because it's urinals. It's random crying, but nothing I can do in here. You hear that? That's the X button being mashed. No results. Window? Nothing? Looks like there's a pole right there, but whatever. Fucking, I'm gone. I guess they're just trying to scare me. Let's check this bathroom out. There's an enemy in here. Several enemies in here. That's okay. We got plenty of ammunition. Everybody gets one. There it is. And you can't check out the stalls at all. I like how the blood stays there. It's cool. Details. Alright. Oh, for fuck's sake. Just forever lost. All right, well, I guess it's time to go up. Oh, I unlocked it. This will bring me out to an area I was just at. I think. Maybe I've never been here before. There's a bunch of enemies in here. I'm wondering, like, I, I'm, I don't feel scared at all, but I'm wondering how I would have responded to this game back when I was, like... 13 or 12 when this thing came out. How old was I? I don't remember. What year did this come out? It's probably in my uh, 10, 11 or something like that. 12. The lock is jammed. The door can't be opened. Ah! So we're still trying to figure shit out. Alright, let me go back through that door where there's enemies. Where there was enemies. It was this one, correct? I like this camera angle. Coast is clear. Yeah, I don't think we've been here before. This looks a little different. The architecture is something I haven't seen before. hearing music like some ambiance in the background oh shit someone's trying to get out of a locker well, I haven't seen this done before have I this reminds me of Cole Veronica right here with that rat in the locker could Cole Veronica have done some uh, some biting so to speak 
Looks like Veronica did come out after this. Nothing useful in the locker. Ah, just a cat. Well, it's nice to see that there's regular animals and regular beings. Oh, shit. I nice see that there's regular beings in this town. Nothing inside. Something just killed that cat. I guess I better investigate. Make sure my gun is fully loaded first. Yep. What killed the cat? Did the cat go out? The cat can't open doors. Should still be in this room. Okay. out still more to that hallway that we haven't explored just got it there's gonna be something out here that's gonna f me up but just the same old same olds same old same olds do they respawn or what it's only one so I guess they don't respawn oh no that, that that's all there is did I check this door Nope, sure haven't. What a camera angle that is. Can't see the surrounding area at all. Oh, we're gonna play some Moonlight Sonata? Huh? Where's Jill when you need her? She knows how to play the piano. We got some ominous music finally playing. What's this? Uh, puzzle time. It's written in blood. A tale of birds without a voice. First flew the greedy pelican, eager for the reward, white wings flailing. Then came a silent dove, flying beyond the pelican, as far as he could. A raven flies in, flying higher than the dove, just to show that he can. A swan glides in, to find a peaceful spot, next to another bird. Jeez! Finally, out comes a crow, coming quickly to a stop yawning and then napping who will show the way who will be the key who will lead to the silver reward i don't fucking know what what's this got to do with a piano though let's investigate it won't open odd doesn't look locked though <sighs> more dead ends No, can't do anything on this side of it. Can I jam it open with a hammer? Can I use a pole? Can I use my pole to... I, I'm, I'm assuming that pole's a weapon. Let me let me check that thing out. Didn't I pick up a pipe or something? Steel pipe. Three inch long steel pipe. Long range, uh, limited use. Three foot long. Oh yeah, that's not gonna get the job done. Especially if you're swinging it like that, swinging it like my grandmother, man. Jeez. I just hope we don't have to rely on that ever. Lord help us if we do. Haven't even checked out what it looks like when you try to swing with a knife. All right, well, what the fuck? That's right, he can like jump, do a back dash. Wonder when that would ever come in handy. Seems like I'd get cornered before getting being able to use that. Well, it's coming close to that time where I think I might have to start saving. But the save point is way back there. I'm getting lost. I'm getting confused now. I don't know where I came in from. I came in from over here, right? Came in from over here. That's why there's new enemies in there. 25 minutes. I'm gonna have to cut the video.
I should probably stop shooting everything that I like, fuck that I come into contact with. There's something else here? Or what? Nobody else here. I don't know if they've been here yet. Okay. Um. Fuck. I gotta cut the footage, guys. Oh, shit. Oh, he tried to grab at me. Alright, guys. Fuck. I'm gonna cut it here. I don't know what's going on. All right, let me just let me just stop right here. Go ahead and pause it. All right, guys. <sighs> if you like the video, feel free to like it. And if you want more, feel free to subscribe. And when we get back with this next video, we will continue searching this area right here. Uh, I, once again, I don't have a save point, so I'm just going to pick it up right here when we get back. But uh, thanks for watching. You know, see you guys next video as we continue on searching this horrible town, Silent Hill. Blind, never played before. And, uh, see you guys next video. Later.